So I'm not going to lie, when that name popped up in the tab up there, I thought it said Etch-A-Sketch. I thought it said Etch-A-Sketch, and that, and that I would be judging the uh, the company that made Etch-A-Sketches. Which, come to think of it, I just I just realized now how I just realized right now how stupid that is because etch, 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 there's never there is no etch a sketch company. Etch a sketches are made by Hasbro, I think. I want to say maybe it's Milton Bradley. I don't know one of those toy companies. But no, we don't have an etch a sketch company. We have EdTech X Holdings Acquisition Corp. A Spackaroonie. This is the boilerplate spac description that Yahoo likes to give us. Uh, already I see more news in here than I usually have for most SPACs. Wait a minute. Not, receives non-compliance, uh, NASDAQ notification? Uh-oh. Oh, no, that's not good. How long has this been a SPAC? Whoa! Was steady at exactly? No, there's no way this chart is right. How can it be steady at exactly 2106 for all of January and then just plummet? Actually, I wonder if this is when, this is when it IPO'd and the, chart, and the chart is wigging out on me. This was 2021, right? Yeah. Why am I seeing articles from eight months ago then? You know what? That might be from. That might be from EdTech X Education, whole, uh, group something, which might be another SPAC. Or or a different company. Yeah, Met. Uh, uh that's that's M E T X. That this is not M E T X. This is E D T X. So I think that none of these have to do with this company. However, this one does. And that's literally all I see. Why well, don't know. Uh, I don't even see an article about initial initial pricing. That would help me determine what exactly this here is about because maybe was it priced here at around this much in that case that would tell me what's going on here because look, there's no volume prior 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 to this clip. I can't, I can't, ex I've never seen this before. I can't explain what, what that's about. Received a letter from the listing qualifications department advising that the company does not comply with NASDAQ rules listing for continued listing because NASDAQ has not received the company's quarterly report. Oh no! Bruh, you literally have no other responsibilities in a, in a company like this other than reporting and looking for a company to merge with, I guess. And, and, you, and you can't even do that right for the fiscal quarter ended March 31st. That it has until July 26th. That's a long time frame, actually. Submit a plan to regain compliance with respect to this delinquent report. Has a discretion to grant the company extension of up to 180 calendar days. Staff of the uh oh, the sick is on their ass. Issued the staff statement and accounting and reporting considerations for warrants issued by SPACs. Um. I know that I usually give pre-announcement SPACs buys by default, but I kind of want to give this one a sell just because of how sketch it looks. I agree. I agree. The real Blake, bottom of the pack. I kind of want to give this a sell just because of how sketch it looks. Or may, may, maybe a hold... And it trades so infrequently at such ridiculously low volumes. I don't know. This, 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 one, this one almost seems like a scam to me because 
the whole purpose of you existing is, is is to stay listed so you can merge with something later. And they can't even and they and they, and they can't. It's not that they can't do it. It's that they apparently don't care enough to make sure they're in compliance to stay listed. So if they don't care enough to want to even keep themselves listed so they can merge with something in the future, why should I care about uh, about about their company, their price or or their stock in any way? It, it's it, it's it, it's kind of like if you don't even respect yourself, how can I have respect for you? You know? So if I can't, if it, if you can't, if you don't even, if you don't have faith enough in yourself to even care about your requirements to stay listed then I can't bring it to myself to care enough about your company, even though it's a SPAC, to care enough about your company to give it anything but a sell. That's my take. <laughs>